All right, it is April 19th, and unfortunately we're coming up on the last full week of shows at the Rogue Bar. And you probably want to know, what awesome shows are there still to check out before the place shuts down? Well, then, let's go! Go bring it in. Yes, welcome to another episode of Every Show Joe Says Go, helping you find music live around Phoenix area and a little outside of Phoenix. Uh, all brought to you by Yucca Tap Room. So be sure to stay till the end. Spotlight a couple of awesome shows coming up actually in the next couple of days over there. And of course, a little housekeeping head over to everyshowjoe.com. I got the Phoenix Skater Con pictures up. They're fucking rad. Go check them out. Hopefully, it sells you on going out to next year's, which will be number five. It's a really cool event. So, I definitely hope I can help sell you on it. This is my second year and had a blast out there. So, go check that out. Um, I guess we're just going to get right into it. Tonight, we've got plenty of stuff. We actually got plenty of stuff for the next couple of days. Um, but one really cool thing is we've got the Declaim. They're celebrating their 20th anniversary over at Chopper John's with We Might Be Wasted, Quantum Colossus, the Cadaver Dabadoos, and From Mars. So really cool punk rock right there. But there's still a lot of cool stuff. So we've got After the Calm and Interfate doing their tour kickoff. They're going on the road. And they got a couple awesome locals here with Inept Hero, No Refills, and As For Me over the Rebel Lounge. And that one's actually starting soon. Yes, there's no watch on my arm. We all use cell phones now. But, yes, I think that's actually starting soon. So, that one, probably we're going to start, and then we're going to figure out where I'm going to go. Like, maybe this other one. We got the maybe next year's with RMA, Boycott, Barico, and Acne, Superstar over Tobacco Row, a venue I've been meaning to get over to and haven't yet. Too much stuff. Too much awesome stuff. But, damn, eventually I'm going to get over there. There's Something's going to happen, and I'll be there for some awesome show, I'm sure. Um, moving on, though, we got Corky's Leather Jacket with 187s playing their first ever show, Border Town Devils and El Googly Diablo over at the Rips Bar. We've got Ghost Cat Attack and Richard Nihill over at Irene's Tap Room. We've got Church Fire with Solopsis, Wayward Son, and Mani Oblivion's back in town playing over at the Grid on this one. So, really cool. Let's check that out. Uh, we've... I can just say we got over and over and over. No. All right. But we there is also Hail to the Leaf 2, which I believe is a 420 reference. And that's featuring Toke. Toki? Toke? Okay. Uh, Scattered Guts, Black Phantom, Intent, Sounds Like Murder, and Ugly over the Yucca Tap Room. We've also got the Psychic Elephants with Genevieve and Hemi and Exploding Oranges over at Time Out Lounge right across the street. There's Sydney Sprague, Paula Ray, Danielle Durack, Terra Fractal, Lemur, and Stony Pie over at Cesarek Phoenix. I've This is the first I've heard of the place, but really awesome show to go check it out. And I know the address is on the event, so it's a public place. Not one of those, not one of those DIY places where you get a message to play someone. So you can always message a band. They probably would give you the address. Uh, <laughs> moving down the list, we got Mr. Incommunicado back playing with Madman Theory. Over at Janie's Coffee Company, we got the Sugar Thieves and Lus Choice Pelagrosis over at the Rhythm Room. Murs with Locksmith Coho and Megaran's back. He's back in the U.S. after an awesome tour from based on his Instagram. So you can go check him out, go support him. He's at the Crescent Ballroom tonight. Plus, we got day one of Green, oh, Days on the Green. With Slightly Stupid, Iration Pepper, Clint Stevens, Pride Through Strife, Torn at the Seam, and more over the Fear Farm. That one actually has started. I know that. There's a, it's a loaded lineup, especially if you're into the big reggae stuff. So you might want to go check that out. Um, And then, let's see, one more. We got Bigger in the Mountains with Cat and Mouse. And Naming Our, yeah, and naming our Monsters, Mr. Owl, at the Hive up in Flagstaff. So if you're looking for an escape, there's that. And it, actually... I, I think there's more coming up over at the Hive. They're getting some cool shows up there. So go check that out. Then moving on to Saturday, we've got Fried Festival. Yes, get your fried food on. Yes, there's plenty of fried food if I was reading it all right. And with it, some awesome local music. We got Fairy Bones. We got Decker. We got Mr. Mud, Mr. Gold. We've got Please. We've got Weird Radicals, Gusty Winds. Oh, ha, ha. I get it now. Uh, and the Breakers, and more over at Margaret T. Hans Park. The legendary Shack Shakers are back in town, which if you haven't caught them, 
They are magnificent. And we've got the Limit Club and Whiskey Kiss over at the Rebel Lounge. Then moving down this list, because it is 420, yes, if you weren't aware. It might explain all this weird green thing. Uh, I mean, there is St. Patty's Day. But let's see here. We've got 420 at Crusty Palms with Quintosis, Earthwalker, Sewer Gap, Asswipe Junkies, Rage and Peace, Fatal Hit, and the Upchucks. Then there is, let's see, Destruction Unit with Leguas Largus, Bloodlust, Jock Club, uh, Rotgen, Divine Hammer, and the Nagina, and Mr. Wax. These are all, well, I've heard of some of these, but some of them I have not pronounced before let's go over that uh there's also tgtg right across the street there with manic monkeys endless muse and vibes at timeout lounge bane wolfkind with funerales and mani oblivion playing over at the lunchbox so you got two days of mani go check that dude out while he's in town super cool um let's see oh and then moving on yes got days on the green part two but dirty heads catastrophe the super villains are back in town who I somehow had just recently discovered last year. I should have discovered them sooner. They're really good. Uh, also, locals like Black Bottom Lighters, Hollow Point Vigils, Sound Bombers, and more. So you can get out there. It's a Saturday, so you actually can actually get out there in time and not have to worry about the traffic that comes with a Friday or getting off your job at like 5.30. So that one might be a little easier to make it out, too. Then we got 420 Fest, as they're calling it, with Happy Mishap, Street Burrito, Turn Zero, and more at Club Red. Got the Lonesome Wilderness playing the Tempe History Museum. And, yeah, like I said, you can just hang up in Flagstaff this weekend, it looks like. We got No Lungs. They're up there with India, Peterson, Acne, Superstar, and Sore Eyes over at the Hive. So, really good stuff coming up there. Sunday, which is Easter, but you wouldn't, I mean, if you even celebrate it, you wouldn't even know. Because there's plenty of stuff to go watch. We got Special Interest with Lena Del Rey's Soft Shoulder, Perplex. This is a band that... They're really good. I didn't even... What, I came across them last year. Or wait. It was one of the Lunchbox... Uh, Save Lunchbox shows. And they don't really have a like social media presence. But they're really good local hardcore band. That kind of just floated under everyone's radar. And I highly recommend them. So definitely check this one out. With also the sheaves on the bill here at the Lunchbox. So a really good Easter show right there. But not the only one. We got Night Beats with Cosmonauts and the Darts. Over at Last Exit Live, as the darts get ready for a new release on Alternative Tentacle Records, too. So that's really cool. I think it's coming out, is it May 4th? It's coming out, I think, the first week of May. So keep an eye out for the darts new album on top. We've got Gutter Town with Earthwalker, 2000 Foot Turtle, and Sore Eyes at Big Surf, the DIY venue, not the water park. But it's, I know it's confusing a little bit. Uh, we also have the Jenna System playing the Ice House. And let's see, Andy Warpigs is playing on Easter here. We got Shane Zen, Voodoo, Cat and Mouse, and Bigger Than Mountains over at the Rhythm Room. Reverend, this is a really killer show up in Flagstaff that I wish we could have this kind of lineup put together down here, but probably worth the drive. We got Reverend Horton Heat, the legendary Shack Shakers, and Hoot and Hollers over at the Orpheum up in Flag. So, holy crap, that is a lineup that I wish I could see all together. Um, let's see, moving on, actually, Monday, we got the Hooten Hollers coming down here. They're going to be playing with the Blood Family Feud sing or Blood Feud Family Singers, sorry. Uh, and it says more, so we'll see if any others get added at the Yucca Tap Room. Plus, one band that I just was listening to their new album, really good, Nanami Ozone. They have a show Monday night with Fever Few, Yippee, and Herbert Walker at the Trunk Space. We got the Punk Rock Art Show, which is more in the idea of the arts being done in a punk vein but there is some awesome music on it we got bittersweet wave we got narwhals jr we got nova miss no me miss navi miss navi miss uh i am hologram and crow speaks band over at the rhythm room and must, this is a busy monday uh worm for painting fences darkness dear boy hostile work environment mississippi nova over at the rogue bar and yes we're on what i think the last week of shows almost at the rogue bar there's Barring a couple days, that'll be on the next update. But I think Saturday may be the biggest one a week from the Saturday. So, yeah. Try to get in all your Rogue Bar for the next week, pretty much. You've been warned. Tuesday, we've got Wild Hum with Narwhals Jr. Wild Hum. Oh, I put him down here twice. Um, so, we've got Wild Hum, Narwhals Jr., and Fawn Flora at the Rogue Bar. 
We also got Los Straight Jackets with Igor and the Red Elvis is back in town over at the Rhythm Room. Um, Wednesday, I got nothing. Go relax. Enjoy your hump day. Then Thursday, we got All the Wine with Ghost in the Willow, Sore Eyes, and Shane Hunt over at the Yucca Tap Room. There's Brian, Brian Damage and the Memories with Ghost Cat Attack, Old Star, Parlor Birds, and Bone Cookie over at Rogue Bar. Then Friday, to wrap up at least this update, we got Playboy Man Baby. They're doing two shows, a double feature. And if you buy the tickets up front for both days, save five bucks and get a tote bag. So there you've also been told about that now. But yeah, so they're doing Playboy Man ba Baby Television is the theme of that night. And that night is also got, what was it, March? We also got American Standards with Mitch playing his last show on drums. So more reason to go out there and check out American Standards, and, well, of course, Playboy Man Baby, plus Bonzales over at the Trunk Space, so a really good lineup right there, plus really good lineup also for Rogue Bar. Got Brolo one more time there with Sanitation Squad, Take Over and Destroy and Dead Canyon at the Rogue Bar. I mean, Brolo, Rogue Bar, been a while since I've seen them there, actually, but that should go over pretty well, I think. Then we got Telekinesis with Sun Talk and Celebration Guns over at the Rebel Lounge, we got three bad jacks back in town. <laughs> no jokes there. Uh, with Creepsville 666, Surfside 4, and let's see, the Voodoo and the Joeys at the Eggadap Room. We got the big show, exclamation mark, with Teppy Sour, the pubes, and Fat Grey Cat over at Timeout Lounge. And one more here. Let's see, we have Snail Mate, the Spider Hole, and Future X is over at the Rhythm Room. So, really good week, actually. Though, Friday looks lighter so far. We'll find out as we get closer. But, yes, awesome stuff coming. And like I said at the top, Yucca's got a couple awesome ones coming up, which you can always get your tickets at yuccatap.com, but now you can also physically purchase them at Yucca or at Shirts and Things. So you can get those things physically in your hands just in case you're worried. <laughs> and that, but let's see, a couple of shows you might want to do that for. We got Hail to the Leaf 2. Tonight, like I said, Toke, Scattered Guts, Fan Black Phantom, Intent, Sounds Like Murder, and Ugly. Tomorrow, we got Destruction Unit with Laguas Largas, Bloodlust, Jock Club, Rontgen, Divine Hammer, Nagina, and Mr. Wax. And Monday, we got the Hootin' Hollers with the Blood Feud Family Singers, plus maybe others. So, some awesome shows right in the next four days over the I Could Have. Of course, as you see, I've got a sponsor. So, that means, as a small guy on the YouTubes, I don't make a ton of money. So you can help me in a couple ways. First, you go know, to patreon.com forward slash every show Joe. Even a dollar helps, goes a long way. If you do the five dollar tier, give you a shout out on here on the next episode, or actually on the next episode of Concerts and Consoles. There you go. Uh, so there's that. Um, so that always helps. Second thing you can do is you can subscribe. If you're watching this on YouTube, there should be at least an icon over this way, if not below. You can hit subscribe, get notifications when these go, when these go live, and when the concerts consoles go live. Um, you can subscribe on iTunes, or well, eventually on iTunes. This is this has become a podcast. If you haven't, it's supposed to. We're still waiting approval on iTunes, but it is on Google Play. It's on what five different ones. You can find it on Anchor.fm slash Every Show Joe Says Go. So you can go check that out, see where it's at. Hopefully, in the next week, it'll show up on iTunes. So there's that. Um, let's see what else. Thank you, Tony of formerly Dumpster Hump for the theme at the top and everyshowjoe.com like I said go check out those SkaterCon 4 pictures from this year awesome stuff really good pictures hopefully selling you on it just saying uh, so I think that's going to be it we're going to wrap up this episode of course as always if you like what you see share it share the music share the band's link page to their page whatever I should actually you know say full sentences do that kind of stuff, though. But share their band camp. Share just stuff. Tell people about them. Sell your friends on them. Because then they're going to grow. They're going to make more music because they're going to keep going as they're growing. And you're going to get more out of it. It's just reciprocal. Bands fully appreciate it. So, yeah. Anyways, until next week, hopefully I see you at a show. And have fun. So, take care. <laughs>